welcome back to my channel today is a drive with me today i am going to get kevin my car a nice little wash and some gas because it's looking a little low and yeah i didn't have anything really to do today so i said why not it's a nice day today so this is what we're gonna do today i had this little interview right for this scholarship and it's gonna be for for school of course you know i'm a college student and i go to school 15 hours away from where i live so i need that money and i'm an engineering major biomedical engineering so this is an engineering scholarship from my program that i'm in so, you know they were asking me these questions and everything i felt like i did good i felt like i did really good Maybe everybody needs some money, so but I just was like, you know, my work ethic it shows that I'm a good student and I go to school 15 hours away, so I pay double of what most of um, the students are paying. So, you know, I'm a good student and I pay a lot of money, so I want to continue to go right. So, I'm gonna need some money so my mom won't have to be paying all this money out of her pocket like she did before okay we trying to get some money so and then i just was talking a little bit about okay talking a little about the stuff that i've done like shadowing and research and all that and so you know just to show them that i got a little experience and my major is real research heavy so yeah okay. people in the city of cleveland cannot drive i'm telling you they be trying to mess your car up so i gotta be real alert Put my phone in front of the speedometer so i don't even know how fast i'm going but we're not gonna talk about that that's why that's okay i feel like I, I can feel it but yeah so it's a very very nice day in the city of cleveland it's been pretty nice every day but today is my rare rare off day Last week, I almost had a mental breakdown because I was working every day. I have two jobs, okay? Two jobs. And I'm in school, so I'm trying to finish up my stuff. So I had to bring my computer to work to finish up my work. And and they let me do it, so just that's just that. But yeah, I just wanted to film a day, a drive with me. Kind of day in my life vlog i don't really know what type of stuff i want on my channel besides like of course some college stuff i might just do like hbcu advice i do attend the illustrious florida agricultural and mechanical university and that's on period <laughs> get into it we love family. I be forgetting how to get to places that I go all the time. I'm like, am I the only person that does something? I'm gonna get the car wash. She said, turn right. So I'm just gonna get over. I know the person behind me is tired of me jumping in front of them. But it is what it is. I need some gas. And so where I want to go, where it's really cheap, it's like out where some ice cream is. And I think I want some ice cream.
anyway hey i'm back y'all back from the car wash that was quick though it was only a little 13 dollars now we are about to venture out here to go get some gas very overwhelmed i guess you could say like i had a lot of schoolwork do and all you know if you're in college you know everything we do like sunday 1159 but i don't know why my math class everything we do sunday nine o'clock how am i supposed to get all these questions done and then i was at work and my manager kept distracting me because she kept having a conversation with me which is cool but i'm like sis i do my work so i end up finished five out of six assignments and then i have a test on the first which is saturday for that and then when i get home today i need to study for a chemistry final because i failed my first i failed my midterm right so i dropped my grade down a lot <coughs> i don't got the wrong one i dropped my grade down a lot so i got it I have to get a seat or above to you know pass the class and so i can register for the rest of my classes at school school so i need to study for that and that is on sunday and i have like something i have a baby shower to go to on sunday so it's like i need to be doing this stuff during the week and i be knowing i be knowing what i gotta do <coughs> i be knowing the stuff that i had to do i just it was one down here too. Wow. I mean, knowing the stuff I need to do, I just don't be doing it. I be a little lazy, a little lazy. But it's it's hard. I I don't know. Some people be saying don't take no classes in the summertime, but it's like for my major, I need to graduate on time. Cause if I if I didn't take these classes in the summer, I would be still behind, like even more behind than I am right now. It's like I have a lot of hard classes, and who's to say when I declare my major that I will pass all these classes? I'm not speaking out into the thing. I'm gonna pass them all, but you just never know, cause like stuff like thermodynamics that just sound hard. So y'all, the gas station I passed. 199. Why well, just pass up gas section? 229. Who about to pay that? If I could just go right down the street. Tried it for real. They tried it, but I'm about to go out, out, and like to one of the sub. Like I'm in the suburb, but further out because I just know. Because when I was out here last time, it was like 193 for gas. And so, and the place I want to go is out here. So, yeah. But yeah, just for school, like. I say if you know that you can sit down and be disciplined in the summertime, go ahead and take some classes because it's really not bad. It's just that I'm taking technically three classes and they're not like, I'm taking Calc 2 and Chemistry 2 and Lab. Like, those not no little classes I could just be like, oh, I'm just going to sit down on the computer one. No, I really had to get on the computer, like, especially for math every day almost just to do the work but i'm not even worried about math because i have an a in that class an a in class because yeah i got an a in there and an a in my lab it's just that chem because i felt the, the midterm and that's because i don't know i just wasn't studying the right stuff i guess and it's not like i couldn't finesse or nothing <laughs> i could not finesse because it's like even though it's online, it still was somebody watching me take my test. So, but yeah, I couldn't finish that test. And so when <laughs> when it was done, I swear I thought I was answering the questions right, bro. But it's literally somebody looking at you through your computer watching you take the test. So then I'm like, dang, I can't even I can't even try to do anything. Like I really gotta sit here and I honestly did not know that stuff that well. So. When I turned that thing in, I said 40 out of 100. Very sad. What? Hold on, hold on. I had to cut the camera right quick, y'all, because my my engineering friends was blowing up my phone talking about, okay, it should the gas drop a 
down. Talking about we got a meeting at 5 o'clock. I got stuff to do, baby. I'm tired of these freaking meetings. We're not even in the same program anymore. School been over. We about to start back up, so why we got to keep going? my ice cream it's called Grand Central Station this like I don't know I got this one time when I came out here and now I get this every time close it's so good it got like graham crackers and chocolate selling chocolates what chocolate I can't hear you they're selling chocolate and I don't know what flavor the ice cream is but we are at Handles a very very good ice cream place out here in the land so so now this is a mukbang too so good Since of this this COVID stuff been going on, like a lot of people, I guess they just you know. I mean, we, we are paying. If you out of state, we are paying a lot of money to go to school, and like me, all my classes online, and I'm not the only person who like that. So I, a lot of people feel like, why should I be paying? you know honest money just to be doing stuff online which I get and I guess if I didn't have signed would it have signed like my whole lease already and put down the money I had to put down maybe I would consider staying home but I don't know, like, I've been here since March, and it's not even, like, I don't be arguing with my mom. It's nothing like that. But I want to, you know, get back with my friends, and when you come home, it's, like, different. Of course, you know, you get to see your family and your friends, so that's, like, a good thing. But, like, I want to get back to my life down there at school. Like, you have so much, so much freedom. It's, like, I, I don't be doing nothing crazy, but it's just, it's just different, so... I want to get back down there and do that. Yeah. And then other people, a lot of people, their parents don't want to go, don't want them to go back down either. Which I guess it's really, it is kind of really bad in Florida, but where our school is in Tallahassee, they have like the, some of the lowest amount of COVID rates. But then the people that do have, that have been getting it are in their 20s. So, but that's because Tallahassee has three colleges there. A lot of people that live in Tallahassee are students. So. But. I really just be thankful that my mom allowed me to go down to school all the way in Florida, like 15 hours away. And then she don't be trying to hold me back from stuff like like she had nurse herself so she know she know how bad COVID is 
but she not making me stay home because she she knows like that's why I'm, my mom she our parents they've lived this life already but my mom she don't be like holding me back from experience and stuff like she's like i know you want to get back down there with your friends i'm like yeah i do i really really do so but she like i'm gonna call you every night to make sure that you wipe everything down doorknobs counters all that and i'm just ready to go down because now i got my car I can go like do more stuff. This lady don't got no mask on. And it clearly say up there, you need a mask. As far as I kinda just wanna go home now and get back in the bed. scooter stuff down in Tallahassee so just me hanging out with my friends like things like that parties you know we're not really doing no parties because of corona she keeps trying to let this ice cream it's gone I swear it's gone like there ain't nothing in there she ate it all I could also do like shop with me grocery shop with me but I don't want to be boring see I don't know what people be wanting to see be like hard to just sit here and talk like to myself but to y'all but to myself but it's actually not because i can talk to myself and i can do a pack with me yeah pack with me drive with me down to school because we are driving like i said it is a 15 a little under 15 hour drive from Cleveland to Tallahassee, so yeah, okay, from Cleveland to Tallahassee, so yeah, that should be interesting, right, uh, I think so, I believe so, ooh, 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 y'all don't hit me, they was about to hit me, Oof. some nachos and lay down so like comment and subscribe on this video thank you for watching all the way to the end and there's many more videos to come bye